attach a picture of me here while I was um, really off a little time. Hello everyone. Happy New Year to all of you. What have we been doing? Traveling? Moving? You know, everything. <laughs> Hope we do better this year. Without wasting much of your time, I'll just go straight to the point. Do you have a reverse effect when you stop using glitter tie-ons? I am here to tell you my experience. I've been traveling. For those of you that have been following me for a long time, you know that I travel a lot. I move a lot. So coming to North America, my skin just like turned to like something else. What I never ever expected. I noticed some very, very interesting effects when I was out of glitter tie-on and which I'm going to be discussing with you guys today. So if you like videos like this about skin, about lifestyle, make sure to subscribe on this video and stay tuned, turn on your notification bell. I actually started getting darker. My skin didn't start looking dark immediately. It took some months. Your skin is gonna get dark when you stop taking glitter tie-on. But how soon does that happen? The main point here. So, what I'm trying to explain here is, when I stopped taking it, I didn't actually experience any darkening of the skin and any side effects. There was nothing, my skin was glowing, I was maintaining my skincare. Coming here, my skin just went crazy. When I mean crazy, my skin totally went nuts. So I struggled with um, open pores. I had very serious open pores around the side of my face. And I went like, well, I say four shades darker. He actually changed my sunscreen. I discovered it wasn't really, the darkening was not totally from the glutathione. It was actually the effects of the sunscreen. The sunscreen I was using before I traveled was different from the sunscreen I started using when I was in North America. Yes, when I was in Dubai, I was actually using some different products. Of course, depends on where you are. Every environment has their have their product, except you want to be shipping products everywhere you are or moving products. I mean, how many can you move? You get. So I just didn't want to go through that phase. I want to like my skin to get used to whatever product is available and in whatever environment I am. So that is how much I have trained my skin to adapt to products i don't want to be so 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 into products that um maybe when i'm traveling i'm freaking out what am i gonna use what am i gonna where am i gonna get it either on whitening supplement or when you're off whitening supplement I not try this particular product i just jumped into it and it just dealt with me the sunscreen i'm talking about is this sorry i know this is gonna break a lot of people's hearts some people might not like this because this sunscreen is loved by many and I won't lie to you I really like this sunscreen because it's one sunscreen that when I apply I just feel the glow and it's very easy to um, um, just sink into my skin without leaving any white um, cast so I really really liked the sunscreen so I was using it and I bought it in bulk <laughs> yes I was using it judiciously I just had to like change my sunscreen you know I just change to this and in less than a week yes in less than a week without even changing skincare my skin just started getting better so my next point is the amount of melanin your skin produces we all have and uh, we all produce them in different amounts depending on the amounts of melanin you produce as a human that is what determines how much or how long your glutathione is going to brighten your skin when you are off it yes some people actually produce more melanin than others so if you are off whitening supplements sometimes it might take you a while before your skin will start getting dark why some people you just start seeing it almost immediately you stop so it just simply means you have a stronger melanin production than the other person okay so now to my next point sorry i'm rushing i don't want this video to be too long because i just wanted you guys to know that um i've been off glutathione for like over a year so i'm 
back so and i'm going to be showing you guys and taking you through my journey my next point is your skin routine sometimes when you're on glutathione you don't need to use much products and suddenly you stop um, taking your glutathione you just relax you're not taking anything um, it's going to reverse quickly so sometimes when you're off glutathione you need to like take your products seriously your skincare products seriously I'm not saying go back and start buying those same whatever organic or whatever you're buying I don't that's not what I'm talking about when I'm talking about your skincare I'm talking about um, natural lightening things like um, Kojic soap Kojic products buy them naturally I'm not talking about buying from people that uses that produces organic or something from well-respected brands you understand that has gone through all the whole process of production um, the scrutinization and everything of production those are the people you should buy your um, Kojic from your skincare routine has a lot to do when you are off glutathione and when you're taking a break or you decide not to like go back to glutathione so my next point is hormonal changes some people have problem with hormonal changes and um, you start noticing most of your products are not working anymore your skin start getting very very bad you start having some skin problems and all of that so that can actually affect you when you're off glutathione you might just notice um, um, your skin is just drastically getting dark so it's not like um, it's really because you're off glutathione it's most of the time your hormonal issues and all of that so I think you should actually address that separately interesting thing about um getting dark when you're off glutathione is that it's uniform you're going to get a uniform um effect like it's going to you're going to be like um just naturally dark let me use that word it won't give you those patches that those um creams i don't want to drag any brand or whatever but you know those cream you used to use that will give you patches when you stop using them or you start looking your skin will start shrinking it's not gonna give you that it's going to give you a uniform um, dark shade when I mean dark it might not be like very very dark or just a bit dark depending on how long you've been off it but you're going to still be glowing I might just attach a picture of me here while I was um, really off glutathione currently back on glutathione eight days in so i'm gonna try as much as possible to um make as much videos so i'm going to be putting you through on my journey and i will update you better this year <laughs> thank you guys for watching and bye bye